Andy King. John Lukic pushing the shot aside as Mark Steen raced in for the rebound. Steen only recently returned from a spell on loan with 4th Division all the shot. After 23 minutes, King's corner clicked on by Ricky Hill and Steve Foster, who helped Brighton to the cup final three years ago, sends Luton on their way to the sixth round. Andy King, who now has the opportunity to face his old club Everton, came agonisingly close to making it 2-0. But a Foster free kick in the seventh minute of the second half did lead to Luton's second. Steen shot hitting Lukic, and it's an own goal off David O'Leary. The goalkeeper left Sealy clearly believing that Luton are taking off for Wembley. And then Mark Steen crowned an unforgettable night with a goal of his own. His first attempt blocked, and then he retrieved the ball for his first senior goal for Luton. So out of David Cleek's problems has come an inspired selection. Steen Mark II had added another chapter to the romance of the FA Cup. He's away from the straight. He's very small, and we've had to buy that time with him. A lot of clubs would have released him by now. He's now 20 but he looks 16 still. And when he came here as a 15-year-old, he looked a 12-year-old. But we persevered, and I would have thought all the it's all been worthwhile, because he was absolutely lovely tonight in everything he did. We've had some cracking guys with Luton this year, in the league and in the cup, and uh, good luck to them. They're through. I hope they go on and win it now. Uh, they've got a good little side here. They've built a nice little team, and... Uh, you know, that fought hard. Really, we should have wrapped it up Monday. We shouldn't have been here tonight. That smashing night all around for Luton Town. I, thought, I thought the football was good. I thought the football was good. I would, uh, um, if someone offers me the video tonight, I'll, I'll take it and watch it. Mark 